Hello students, I am Priyanka and I am your mentor. Today we will start with the chapter number 10 that is Mineral Resources of India. So let's kick starts. Match these things with the metals from which they are made. So the process of mining involves digging the earth at suitable places to take out the minerals. They are formed naturally in a earth. Most of them are found in rocks. Some rocks contain only one mineral, while others may contain more than one mineral. The place from where these minerals are taken out by digging is known as a mine. India is rich in mineral resources. So let's see the types of mineral. How many types of minerals we have? Minerals can be classified into two types that are metallic minerals and non-metallic minerals. So let's study about metallic minerals first. Metallic minerals are those minerals which yield metals after being processed. Iron, copper, aluminium, gold, Silver and platinum are some examples of metallic minerals. Iron. Iron is the most important mineral in our country. It is used for making utensils, machines, tools, railway tracks, railway coaches, automobiles, ships, etc. Iron is obtained from iron ore. The iron ore is found in Jharkhand, Odisha, Chhattisgarh, West Bengal, Madhya Pradesh, Maharashtra, Karnataka and Andhra Pradesh. Iron ore is purified in big factories called iron and steel plants. There are big iron and steel plants at Rurkela, Durgapur, Bhilai and Bukaro. Copper. Copper is used for making electric wires, machinery, pipes, vessels, utensils, etc. It is extracted from Rajasthan and Jharkhand. Now see what manganese is. India has the second largest reserves of manganese ore in the world after Zimbabwe. It is used in Chennai. It is used in chemical, glass and steel industries. It is found in Andhra Pradesh, Karnataka, Odisha and Goa. Aluminium. Aluminium is extracted from bauxite. It is used for making utensils, electrical parts and aeroplanes. It is found in Maharashtra, Kerala, Jharkhand, Odisha, Madhya Pradesh and Karnataka. Gold. Gold mines are found in Karnataka and Andhra Pradesh. Now see where we find gold. Gold mines are found in Karnataka and Andhra Pradesh. It is used for making jewelry. Okay, now we are moving towards the non-metallic minerals. So we'll see how many types of non-metallic minerals we have and what is the work of them? Non-metallic minerals. All minerals other than those carrying metals are called non-metallic minerals. Coal, petroleum, gravel and salt are non-metallic minerals. The first one is coal. Coal is one of the valuable fuels. It is formed from trees and plants that lived millions of years ago and were buried under the ground. The heat inside the earth changed the decomposed tree over millions of years into coal. It is used to generate power and domestic fuel. Coal reserves are located in the states of Chhattisgarh, Odisha, Jharkhand, Madhya Pradesh, West Bengal, Telangana and Maharashtra. Petroleum or mineral oil. Petroleum or mineral oil is found deep inside the earth and under the seabed. It has to be pumped out. 
the areas where oil is found is called an oil field when crude oil is refined it gives petrol diesel kerosene spirit cooking gas and many other useful products most of the oil fields are in digboi in assam ankaleshwar in gujarat and bombay high offshore near mumbai the other products that we get out this mineral oil are kerosene lubricants the other products that we get out of this mineral oil are kerosene lubricants vaseline and paraffin wax mineral oil is also used for dry cleaning natural gas is used for cooking at home and running factories and vehicles also we get natural gas from underground wells now see mica india produces largest amount of mica in the world it is found in bihar jharkhand and andhra pradesh it is used for making medicines electrical goods radio sets and paints now see how we conserve our minerals so conservation of minerals the mineral resources of earth are limited they take millions of years to form thus it is necessary to use them wisely and conserve them for example in place of petroleum and coal we should try to use other source of energy like sun wind and water we must protect the mineral wealth of our country at all cost now it's time for tits and bits jharkhand and rajasthan are the richest state in india in terms of mineral wealth now it's time to looking back the process of mining involves digging the earth at suitable place to take out the minerals metallic minerals are some minerals metallic minerals are those minerals which yield metals after being processed the iron ore is found in jharkhand orissa chatisgarh west bengal madhya pradesh maharashtra karnataka and andhra pradesh india has the second largest reserves of manganese ore in the world after zimbabwe aluminium is extracted from bauxite and the last one is the heat inside the earth change the decomposed tree over millions of years into coal now children it's time to take your leave we'll meet in the next chapter bye